What's up? Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Ride and Eat. I am your host, Chef Natalie, and every single Wednesday I am bringing you a new plant-based meal that I cook in or right outside of my van, along with some tips, tricks, and hopefully some laughs every single Wednesday. So make sure you stick around and also make sure you like and subscribe, give us some comments, virtual hugs. It really helps us out. <sighs> no blooper there. Today, we're making a superfoods salad. Yes, we give a crap about our health, okay? The last couple weeks, I've been going ham on some hearty, more fattening vegan food. The reason for this is because I'm trying to make sure I can get those non-believers to get into vegan food, so I felt like I need to do that. But today, we are going to take a little step back and do a, something a little bit lighter. Superfood salad is basically an array of nutrition. It's got a lot of nuts, whole grains, seeds, dark leafy greens, and everything in between. And the beauty about salad is you can literally do whatever you want with it. As long as you're picking things that are going to help you maintain a dope diet, then it doesn't really matter. You can put in it whatever the hell you want. You can make an awesome dressing. So today we're gonna make one. This is our take. I'm gonna give you a few tips of things that you can put in a salad and do it your own way, but this is the way that we're gonna do it today. So if you're interested, stick around. So we'll have that link in the description for you to try this particular salad. And let's get right into it. First things first, our beer of the week. We are going with Farm Island Brewing. This is an organic IPA. I felt like it was fitting going with our superfood salad. It is from Portland, Maine. Cheers. Ooh, that's freaking good. Dude, that tastes organic. That tastes healthy. We've got our dark vegetables and dark leafy greens, which are packed with fiber and vitamins and minerals. I say the trick with kale because not everybody likes kale is to cut it very, very, very thin you don't want a big chunk in your salad like this that's ridiculous but if you shred it it's a great freaking salad especially when you have a dope dressing to coat it in blackberries at abbey forged in stockton state forest in new york they are so freaking good so we're cooking our broccoli I'm just doing a little salted water. This brings out the beautiful color and it's gonna make it nice and tender. Just a couple minutes on that. Pretty organic broccoletti. We've got sweet potato, which is a very healthy source of carbohydrates. Low in starch, very yummy for the tummy. In the same boiling water, I'm putting in our sweet potatoes. Let those babies cook. All right, potatoes are fork tender. Taking those babies out. I'm going to pull them down with the essence of the wind. It's the beats. What was that, Portlandia? Mm -hmm. If you guys don't know, watch that episode. It's hilarious. Pretty much anything purple is good for you and it's high in antioxidants. So eat purple things. In the same water, conserving water, we're gonna throw in our beets, cook them till they're fork tender. Lovely. So you know it was hot, so I had to take off that chef coat, okay? We're gonna start with some fresh ginger for our dressing. Ginger is excellent for your gut. If you have a nauseous stomach, that's great, but it's also just good for you. Don't ask me why I'm not a nutritionist, it just is, okay? One whole beet. Do a little bit of that liquid smoke. You know, I talk about it all the time. A couple of dashes. Got our Bragg's apple cider vinegar. Boom. I'm also going to do some lemon in this because I want the freshness. Lemon also boosts your metabolism. So that's a win win. I'm going to use some of the zest. This makes it even brighter. Just a little bit. A quarter of the juice. If you don't have a juicer, just put your hand over. Catch the seeds. To that, we are adding our tahini and miso. I have both of those in here. I am using a shiro miso. You can find that in the grocery store or the Asian market. Also adding a little bit of Dijon mustard. We're also adding some organic raw blue agave, normally made for tequila. Okay, can't go wrong with that. And a little bit of salt and pepper, and that's all she wrote. Then baby up. I am gonna be doing some black rice. This is also known as forbidden rice. It's a Chinese rice. This stuff is so freaking dope. If you've never tried it, you should check it out. This is super high in antioxidants, fiber, iron, and protein, and it's a whole grain. So, I mean, you can't beat it. We're doing our rice in that same beet juice. 
Parsley. Parsley is actually awesome for you. It also cleanses your gut. Smoked almonds. Because they're high in protein. And they're so freaking good. Now we're seasoning and searing our tempeh. Doing a little bit of organic ground turmeric. So turmeric is also an excellent anti-inflammatory. Um, everything in here is just... It's super healthy. It's so good. Oh my God. I love when I get a good avocado. Look at that baby. Perfect. Pro tip to get out your avocado and keep it looking nice. Use a spoon and you're just going to follow the edge and turn the avocado as you do so. And look at that. Make sure you get out this little piece, the little butt piece. You do not want to have that in there. But now we've got a beautiful avocado that we can just fan out for our salad. Y'all, look at this salad right now. Do you see this thing? Oh, that's going to be a feast. Look at this rice. This has got an amazing chew on it. You got to boil this in about 30 minutes. This stuff is amazing. And it just looks beautiful. Last but not least, bam, look at that. That is our miso tahini smoked beetroot dressing, okay? And that's all she wrote. Look at that dressing, dude. Come on, look at that dressing. Mmm. Dude. I don't know about you, but that salad looks pretty freaking dope. Again, if you are not into salads, you can do whatever you want to make the salad taste good, okay? This is my take on a superfood salad. It's packed with nutrients and vitamins, okay? We're at this dope-ass campsite with this beautiful lake, so we're gonna eat this, and I hope you guys Get inspired to make your own healthy food. Like I said, I wanted to switch it up. I know I do a lot of heavy things, but I promise you Abby and I eat very healthy and very clean. So recipe will be in the description box. Make sure you like and subscribe and we will catch you next Wednesday. Bye. You wanna try it, Abby? Mm-hmm. There you go, I'm gonna give you a little sip. <laughs> okay, I want an actual sip. We've got blackberries that we actually, Abby forged these while we were in New York. Where are we at? In a forest in New York. We've got Stockton Black State Forest. Okay. There are flies in the bathroom.